Megan Gymnast and welcome back sa aking panibagong tutorial video. At kung bawa lang sa YouTube channel, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, at click ang notification bell button para update kayo sa every video ng videos ko kagaya nito. So, ano nga mga kanaisi? Ngayon po, for sa vlog na ito, ay pag-uusapan po natin ng tungkol sa loss of exponent for multiplication. So, tara na! Lesson for today is all about loss of exponents for multiplication. Multiplying powers with like bases. Okay? This is our first example. B raised to A times B raised to B. Ang ibig sabihin po nitong tulok po dito ay multiply or multiplication. Ito namang dalawang B po natin dito sa ibaba. Yan po ang tinatawag po nating base. At ito namang um, A po sa itaas at B sa itaas din. Yan po ang tinatawag naman po nating positive integers or exponent. Okay, let's proceed. Okay, i-multiply na po natin itong B and B. B times B is equal to B and copy lang po natin dito. And kapag magkaparehas po ang ating base, i-add lang po natin ang ating exponents. Okay? A plus B. Lagay natin dito. And A plus B. And this is now our final answer. B raised to A plus B. Okay, let's have our second example. X raised to 4 times X raised to 3. Okay, same process. I-multiply po natin ang ating base, which is yung x, okay? x times x is equal to x. Lagay na po natin dito, i-copy lang po natin. And then we add our exponent, which is yung 4 and 3. 4 plus 3. So, we simplify. Hindi pa po, po ito ang ating final answer. So, i-add po po natin ang ating exponent, which is yung 4 and 3. 4 plus 3 is equal to 7. So, lagay natin dito x. And then, 4 plus 3, 7. And this is now our final answer. X raised to 7. Okay, let's have our next example. Cos to in parenthesis, 3 raised to 2. And 3 raised to 4. Okay, same process. I-copy lang po natin ang ating base na 3. Hindi ko na po sila i-multiply kasi po magkaparehas po ang kanilang base which is yung 3. Ayan, itong 3 natin dito. Next naman po is i-add po natin ang ating exponent. Lagay natin dito, 2 plus 4. Next process. We copy yung 3. And then, i-add po natin ang ating exponent, 2 plus 4 is equal to 6. At dahil nga po, 3 raised to 6, hindi po yan ang ating final answer. Ang gagawin po natin dyan is ganito. 3 times 3 times 3 ulit, times 3 times 3 and times 3 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 kasi 3 raised to 6. Okay? We multiply. 3 times 3 is equal to 9. 9 times 3 is equal to 27. 27 times 3 is equal to Okay, we observe. 27 times 3 is equal to 81. 81 times 3 is equal to 243. 243 times 3 is equal to okay, 729. At dahil ito nga po ang ating um, huling sagot, 729, lagay natin dito, 729. And this is now our final answer. Yeah. 
yung 729. Ito na po ang ating ikaapat na example. 2x squared y cubed z times 5xy squared. Okay, let's start. Dahil itong base po natin na 2 and 5, is hindi po sila magkapareho, kaya multiply po natin yan. 2 times 5 is equal to 10. Itong x po natin dito na base, is meron po siyang kapareho sa kabila na base din na x, kaya i-copy po natin yan. X. And then we add ang kanyang exponent na 2 and automatic din na exponent dito na 1. So, 2 plus 1. Itong y, meron po siya kapareho dito sa kabila na base din, kaya i-copy natin yan, y, and then add, simply add, ang kanyang exponent na 3 and 2. 3 plus 2. Itong z, may kapareho ba siya? Wala. Pero, ang gagawin po natin dyan, ikakopy po natin yan. Dito. Okay? Z. Next. Itong 10 po natin dito na base, is we simply bring down lang po natin yan. And then, itong x raised to 2 plus 1, i-add po natin exponent, 2 plus 1 is equal to 3. So, ayan. Kaya magiging x cubed. Itong y din, i-add po natin ang kanyang exponent, 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. At magiging y raised to 5. And then we bring down simply ang z. And this is now our final answer sa ating ikaapat na example. 10x cubed y raised to 5z. Okay, let's have gymnast vlog drill. Directions. Perform the indicated operation below. Ang mga example pa natin dyan is number 1, 5 raised to 5 times 5 raised to 4. Number 2, negative 7, x to the power of 4, z raised to 8, times 4x raised to 5, y squared. You may now start to answer. Which is yung, which is yung 5 raised to 9. Okay, number 2. Negative 7, x raised to 4, z raised to 8, times 4, x to the power of 5, y squared. So, first po natin gagawin siyaan is imumultiply po natin ang ating base na negative 7 and 4. Negative 7 times 4 is equal to negative 28. And then, we copy yung x natin dito na magkapareho. 
And then we add ang kanilang exponent, which is yung 4 and 5. 4 plus 5. Observe nga po natin, itong Z and Y. Kapag masagot po tayo, kailangan po is nasa alphabetical order po yung pagsagot. Kaya, unahin po natin na isulat dito yung Y squared. Y squared, kasunod yung Z raised to 8. Z raised to 8. Next process. We simply bring down yung negative 28 dito sa baba, as well as yung X. And then, we add ang kanilang exponent, which is yung 4 plus 5 is equal to 9. Kaya, magiging x raised to 9. Next, i-bring down po natin itong y. Ayan, y squared. And, z raised to 8. And, this is now our final answer. Sa ating example number 2. Sa ating gymnast vlog drill. Negative 28, x raised to 9, y squared, z raised to 8. Congratulations po sa lahat po na nakatama po ng sagot sa ating gymnast vlog drill. Just comment down below po kung nakatama po kayo sa pagsagot. At yun na po yung vlog ko for today, mga kanaisi. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, at i-click ang notification bell button para updated nga kayo sa video ng videos ko. So, thanks for watching po mga kanaisi. At sana, may natutunan po kayo sa akin. Goodbye po mga kanaisi. And dream big. Bye-bye po! See you next time in my next vlog po mga kanaisi.